After their 2020 season was shortened due to the coronavirus pandemic, San Diego State baseball prepares to make up for lost time as they gear up for the upcoming 2021 campaign. Returning senior outfielder Mike Jarvis and junior right-handed pitcher Troy Melton say that after months of no baseball, what they're most excited for is getting back out on the field. Just playing with my team again. Um, Yeah, honestly, just the enjoyment of playing with them again and being in the locker room again. Yeah, it's been fun getting back out there uh, the last couple of weeks just practicing. So I can't, yeah, I just can't wait to uh, just play with them again. Pretty much just getting back on the field because it's been so long since the last time we played and we didn't get a chance to even play for a conference tournament or anything like that. So just being able to get back and playing against other teams for the first time in like 10 months now, it's going to be fun just to have that competition back and we're just looking forward to getting ready to go. I think the biggest thing is just getting our guys on the field. I mean, I, I just can't wait to see that, you know, actually play a real game. You know, I think the first big hurdle was getting them on the field this fall and getting them back from Christmas break and seeing their smiles and how much fun they're having out playing. Now that the next big one is, is managing games. They haven't played forever. I think it's going to be interesting. It's going to be a great challenge for us. I'm looking forward to it. In addition to a familiar slate of returning players, the Aztecs will be adding nine new faces to their roster. Eight of the new freshmen were ranked in Perfect Games list of the country's top 500 players. We have some really good freshmen that are pushing some of our older guys, you know, for playing time. So it's, again, the intercompetition for jobs is still in play and and we're about three weeks out from playing. So we'll, it'll tighten up as we get closer, but it's a lot of fun to go out there and watch them compete right now. Former SDSU infielder Anthony Walters and third baseman and pitcher Casey Schmidt will not be returning to the Mesa this year. Both of them were picked up in the 2020 MLB draft. We're returning pretty much our entire team. Uh, Obviously, we're missing Walters and Schmidt. Uh, So those are two of our best players, obviously, but uh, they've gone on and continued their careers. So we're happy for them. But I think we've done a pretty good job filling those two spots. I think we're still a really good team. Our pitching staff got better. Um, So just a lot of things we've just improved and we've gotten older and more experienced. So. Um, I think we're in a really good spot to be a really good team this year, yeah. The 2021 campaign will look a bit different. With the ongoing pandemic, COVID protocols have been put into place that the team and coaching staff must adhere to in order to remain safe. We don't like, you know, not being able to socialize as much as we've done in the past. And our guys have been asked to make a huge commitment. And, and if you think about that, is that, you know, the commitment is, is that you're basically going to shut yourself in your room. You're going to do your classes. You, you can go out to get groceries or whatever, and then you can come to practice and then you got to go back to your room. And it, that's a big ask, you know, and it's a big ask being an 18 to 22 year old um, person to, to do that. One of those restrictions involves the removal of in-person attendance. What this means for the team, no fans. Uh, just a little bit of the excitement is taken away, but, you know, we can create our own energy and excitement anyway. So um, I'd rather have the fans there, but I don't think it should be hindering our performance anyway. Aside from an empty Tony Gwynn Stadium, the team's schedule will also be looking different this season. Teams will be playing two days as opposed to their typical three, with a doubleheader on Saturday and a single game on Sunday. This leaves five days in between each series. You know, playing 18 innings on one day is is a lot, um, not only mentally, but physically. And so we have to be very careful how we move those those parts in and out to, to make sure they're healthy and safe the entire year. Despite all the challenges they may face, the team does have their goal in mind. Win the national championship, be safe, and have fun. But a winning season starts with a winning mentality. Our goal has always been to win a national championship. I think that really goes into your day-to-day work habits and your your focus on the right things and your focus on process rather than um, something that, that's a, a faraway place. I think if you work on every day, there's going to be great w- reward on the back end. The goal every year is to win the national championship, go to Omaha. Um, but the first step to that is just winning every day at practice and then winning each individual game and treating every day like as if it is going to Omaha, as if that's on the line. SDSU's home opener will be on Friday, February 19th against the University of San Diego. First pitch is at 6 p.m. And for the Daily Aztec, I'm Reese Savoy.